What's going on, everybody? Well, more and more fake autos have keep surfacing with the uh, Panini Authentic sticker. And I want to go through and start showing some of this to everybody. Some of this stuff is a little bit older till we talked about it. But now there's just more and more going on through creativity of it to where I want to show everybody just to be aware. This is going on in eBay and Macari both. So I'm not too sure. These people could be having this stuff at card shows. People might be like, oh, it has a penny sticker on it. It's good. It says it's authentic on the back, but it's not. So let's get back into this real quick because this is going a little crazy anymore. And there's a lot written on Blowout about it. But we started hitting the Macari thing probably about a month or two ago with these fake autos going on out there. So let me pull this up. There we go. So here we go. This is um, supposed to be Illusions Tom Brady Auto. Now it's kind of hard to tell, but you can see right up in here where the Panini is on to it. So we scroll down right there. This autograph is guaranteed by Panini America Incorporated. The first clue that gives you this is a fake is this Tom Brady's not numbered. We know currently all these new products if there's a tom brady auto or mahomes they're serial numbered one out of five six out of 15 whatever it may be the other part is this font and everything down here is completely off on the card so it's not serial numbered but at first glance if you're new to the hobby you might be like oh it's pretty authenticated and just drive on not realizing that it should be serial numbered and this font's wrong so i'm going to scroll Oh, wrong page. All right, so that's just one. There was another one I want to show everybody here. So be careful on to the um, autographs now. Make sure if you're looking, they're numbered. I know there's the printing plate where they're plopping stickers on, too. It's kind of hard, but you got to really dig into to find out was this card produced or not. I even know some people are uh, pinging Panini on to it, ask them, was this card produced? So let me flip it here. All right, this is where I want to get at onto this one here. So look, valid, genuine with a little uh, seal on top here. Crazy, huh? XR. Now they all think that this is uh, Will Hauser doing it, but I can tell you now there's been people doing it way before him. But this is just starting to get crazier and crazier. Valid, genuine, first, the sticker would not be on there. The second part you're looking at, all right, we're back with Panini. You can kind of see it on there. Kind of looks like his autograph in a way. But I'm not an autograph authenticator, so I couldn't tell you. But when I come on the back, Penny never puts this on the side of a card reading this way. Ne I've never seen it. It's usually written somewhere here. or It's always going across. So, again, fake jaw out there now. I mean, there's nothing these guys won't do. And the other thing is, if this was coming from Panini, it would have a Panini tamper-proof thing up there. And I don't believe they come in BCW holders. So let's keep going down here. This is the Mahomes we talked about that's real. Because remember, there was another one on Macari that didn't have the serial number on it. But that's what it should look like there. The autograph is guaranteed by Panini. And if you look, that there, that off. And I'll just show you guys here. So you can see the font there. And you can tell the font here is definitely a different script, which I probably have to blow this up to show you guys. So hold on. Where's the control key at? There we go. About the best I'm going to get there, but you can tell the font there. And the font here is definitely different. I'm going to bring that back down a little bit. All right. So... There's the Mahomes, like I said, fake text at the bottom onto it. Oh, there we go. Never mind. He had it down below here. So you can just tell. Plus, it's not serial numbered. There was another thing. They linked it out to here. This guy is inactive now. Inactive. So this was the who they said was the Matt Hauser dude or whatever, but inactive user, 200 cells. 200 makes you wonder how many are out there right now but just to bring it back on to it you you got to be careful what you're buying out there if you see stuff that doesn't look right it's probably not right 
just a lot of fake stuff going on throughout the industry right now. And see, this this was actually tagged, and you guys remember this, where HGA um, said they graded the card, not the autograph, okay, for one. But two, if you're going to grade the card, don't you need to make sure it was a real card produced? I don't know. But that's that was another video a while back. Just one of the things that upset me with some of the grading companies. They always try to find a loophole to why their mistake is uh, is acceptable out there. There was something else. Let me just see if I flip through this real quick here. Let's just go through these fake Tom Brady printing plates. Just some horrible stuff on to it going on. Well, there's one that's certified by PSA DNA. They're saying it's fake. But, I mean, without me going through and reading it all, I, I can't really guess that at all. The ones I wanted to bring to your attention are the ones that should be serial numbered that aren't. At the same time frame, they're just throwing a different font up there saying that it's, you know, a certified autograph by Panini America. But... A little bit of a recap from a video we did a while back, but I want to bring it forward because this stuff is still surfacing today out there. And a lot of people are going to start wanting to get into football and everything else with it coming out. Just be careful what you're buying out there. Make sure the cards check out across the board. And hopefully this does not happen to you. I got a few other videos that will be coming out here on some uh, other scammers that are going on right now out there with uh autographs and everything else so be on the lookout for those videos as well uh, let me just see what i had here uh, nope, nope. okay i just wanted to make sure i covered everything into that real quick on to it better night everybody have a good weekend or have a good week sorry i'm still celebrating sunday today i'm just getting videos out for the rest of the week but i will catch you guys next video Take care.